Hey guys, it's Lita. So it's totally in the middle of the night right now at 1.30 in the morning. Um, and I just decided to make a Q&A video that I said I would make a couple of days ago, but I got preoccupied with other stuff. So, yeah, and I know my bed is totally messy. Bye. If you could poop in any toilet in the entire world, whose toilet would it be and why? I would have to say that I would poop in Chuck Norris's toilet because he's Chuck Norris. How do you handle all the rumors being spread about you lately? <laughs> and to be honest, I just try to let them roll off my shoulder because I know that whoever started those rumors probably, like, it's probably like a 99.9% .9 chance that they have never met me in real life. And so I just keep it in my mind that they have never met me and they don't know me. There's no relevance to the rumor. So, <clears throat> you know, I know a lot of people probably believe them and stuff, but, you know, as long as I know that they're not true, then that's okay. I mean, I, I don't usually try to justify myself. Uh, a couple of cases I have tried to justify myself, and that hasn't really worked out. It didn't really change anything, so I just kind of, like, let it go and wait for it to die down. What is your favorite place in World of Warcraft? I'm pretty sure I already answered this before. But, I have several favorite places in World of Warcraft. I would have to say that they're mostly all the Night Elf places, because they're all like pretty and purpley and stuff, and shiny, and there's little wisps everywhere, and, and you know, and yeah. And, um, so I'd have to say like Ashenvale, Teldrassil, uh, Mount Hyjal, places like that, you know. And I also like Silvermoon a lot, because Silvermoon's, Silvermoon's awesome. Lita, how do you feel about mustaches? I think mustaches are grand. So, yeah. I, I personally would never have one. But, they're, they're rad. How do you feel about the SOPA or SOPA and PIPA bills? <sighs> to be honest, when I first heard about it, I cried. <laughs> I know, that's... That's kind of lame, but I cried because it was upsetting. Would you allow Frodo to hide in your house if he was being chased by the Nazgul? And would you make him some pancakes if he insisted? Oh, and would you braid Gimli's beard if he asked you to? Uh, I think I would consider letting Frodo in my house if he was being chased. Um, <clears throat> but, um, if, if there was any sign of, um, you know, the Nazgul coming to my house, I'd probably just leave and <clears throat> hope for the best. <laughs> and uh, if Frodo asked me to make pancakes, I would tell him that unfortunately I do not know how to make pancakes. Yeah. Sad. And would I braid Gimli's beard if he asked me to? I would braid Gimli's beard even if he didn't ask me to. Even if he didn't want me to braid his beard, I would braid his beard, because it is a beard, and it is Gimli, and it is braiding. And he's a dwarf. And it's Lord of the Rings. I would braid anything from Lord of the Rings. I am a raptor. This one is a little bit more of a serious question. Um, why have you changed so much in the past year? Been like an issue... Not, not an issue, but it just like something that's come up quite a few times um, this year. Uh, to be honest, um, I'm growing up. I'm almost 18 years old, and you know that's people grow up, and I'm growing up, and you know I'm still the same person. And as for my appearance, I know that's changed a lot too. Um, but it's not necessarily me changing, um, it's more of just me showing my different sides because, I mean, a one-dimensional person with one side isn't that exciting. And that's just the way that I am. I just have a bunch of different sides that I haven't even discovered, and so when I do discover a new side of myself, you know, I like to try and express it. And so that's kind of like how, how, what's been going down. <laughs> so. Yeah, <laughs> that's that's pretty much my, my complete answer, is that I'm not, I wouldn't really consider it changing uh, at all. 
I'll just consider it growing up because that's a natural thing that human beings do. Unless you're a vampire. But, yeah. Anyway, and um, also that I'm just showing different sides of myself and expressing different different points, you know. Because I do, I do um, base myself off of things, off of my experiences, pretty much. Um, so, you know, if something bad happens, that'll become a part of me. If something great happens, that'll become a part of me, too. And, you know, it just all adds up, and it shaped me into who I am, and it's constantly shaping me into, into, not different things, but it's, it's just, you know, like, like Ditto, the freaking Pokemon. He just, I'm, I'm like Ditto. I think everybody is like Ditto in a way, so. Okay, well, anyway, um, I should probably go to sleep, because, because, yeah, it's almost two in the morning. So, okay. I love you guys so much, and I'll try to make <clears throat> more videos really soon. And stuff. Okay. I love you guys very much. Okay. Okay. Okay, guys. I will see you later. Bye.